This is garter tab cast on for triangular shawls. So we start with the two ends of the circular needle and we do a slip stitch such and put it on the backmost needle slip it up and tighten it then we have the tail end which goes towards the back and the uh, yarn end which goes towards the front over your thumb and the tail end goes on to, or your pointy finger goes around from the bottom round round again now we've made two stitches on each we do another stitch on each needle so we have three stitches on each needle and we take the tail end yarn and take it down and lock it uh, with the ball with the yarn end and then we pull the back needle through so we have the three stitches sitting on the wire and then we want to start knitting those three stitches on the needle which are locked in So here we start knitting these three stitches. And that's our first row. So we turn the knitting around and knit our second row. We want to knit 14 rows all together. So here we cheat a little bit and magically we have 14 rows. Now after 14 rows we want to look for these uh, bumps at the edges of each row. There should be seven of them. Mm. Yeah, And at the end, to, sit, to make sure that we've done 14 and are on the right side, we should have those um, a pearl row at the end. So we pull the last uh, row of stitches through the second needle and then we use the second needle to pick up seven stitches along the edge, each in their little bump. And here we can see which bump I'm talking about this bump here that you have at the end we knit through that now we have two and the third one here knit through that one so we simply put the uh, the left hand needle in through the bump and use the right hand needle to knit it with and uh, then we knit another one through this bump here so we now have the three that we began with and then five picked up stitches so we want to pick up number six here And then the last one is a bit more tricky because we're close to the end. So we knit the seventh stitch. And then finally we've picked up all the stitches we want. So we have the three stitches to begin with. And then the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stitches that we've picked up. Now we want to knit the three stitches at the end. And here I start out by doing it wrong. I should have gone through the back loop of the first one. I'll do this in the second one. So you can see, back loop. And the third one, and the last one, is the slip stitch. So it doesn't really matter which way I go in there. So we finished off. 
we have on the right side. So here we count from one in three. We have the uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stitches we picked up. And if we look at it from the wrong side, we see the broke pearl.